Hello and welcome to New Europe Studios, where you can watch us make the news. My guest today, sitting on my left, is uh, Axel Dubus, the uh, co-author of a new book called Belge and Butz, Petite Histoire de Diable. Um, how would this uh, title translate into English? Um, well, actually, it's a um, play on words on Belzebut, which uh, sounds like Belz, uh, Belzebuth. Uh, the the mm -hmm. devil, yeah, because we were not supposed to use the the, the name Red Devil, okay, because uh, it was uh, it was censored or we had to pay or mm -hmm. so it means uh, Belgian debut, uh, Belgians and goals, mm -hmm. but right, and uh, it's a sort of um, the short the s the small history of the Red Devils, okay, from uh, more than a century now. Okay. Uh, for all you uh, viewers that don't know, the Red Devils um, is the nickname of the Belgian national uh, soccer team. Yeah. And uh, could you, so this is a collection of anecdotes. Yeah. Um, could you maybe highlight one anecdote that you thought was special? One anecdote. Well, for example, the, the first, and we, uh, I think Belgium has only won two titles in, in, its, in, in the, the whole history. Mm -hmm. The first one is the, the gold medal at the Olympics in 1920 in Antwerp. They played only uh, 40 minutes because it was against the Czech Republic. And the Czech Republic, uh, the, the Czechs were uh, very angry at the, the way uh, things were going, the, the referee and stuff like that. So we, mm -hmm. we decided not to come back after the first half. Okay. And um, that was uh, so the, the, the gold medal for the Belgian team. But also, they, they could choose, uh, now they have huge uh, amounts of money when they win something. Mm -hmm. But at the time, they could, uh, they could uh, choose between a, a vase, uh, um, uh, la vaisselle. What you did la vaisselle, c'est malin, j'étais prendre des noms en français. I mean, the, the whole dishes. Yeah, uh, yeah, the, the whole dishes, yeah, et cetera, yeah. That's what they won at the time. Uh, at, uh, that was in 1920. That's a, that's a very Long time ago. Yeah, that's a very and nice they, prize. Yeah, they have a, they win a, they, they receive a Ferrari just when they show up on mm -hmm. a television, not a time. Uh, could you tell me a little bit about the process that went into uh, writing this book together with uh, Mathieu Vellu? Yes, that's, uh, this book means uh, like 30 years of watching football on television, okay. uh, uh, hearing on the radio and reading books and uh, newspapers. So that's all we know and all we co uh, everything we collected throughout the years. And it's always in a funny way, of course. It's not the whole history of the of the of the Belgian team, but little things, little quotes, um, city rankings, or stuff like that. But always um, with a a sense of uh, lightness. We we want to be light and funny, and uh, that means that we also speak to women <laughs> who doesn't. All right. Who don't like football? Okay, very good. You're going for a broad audience. Um, so uh, obviously, this book is about football and the Belgian squad. Yep. Um, the World Cup uh, is coming up in Brazil. Mm -hmm. How do you think? Um, there's a World Cup this year. There's a World Cup this year. There's a World Cup this year. Yes, there's a World um, Cup. This what are your uh, predictions for the World Cup? How will? Um, I think we're going to be. Uh, well. We're going, we're going through the first round, that's for sure. But afterwards, it's going to be very tricky because oh. uh, we, we, we have a lack of experience All right. against great teams. But that's not the, the content of mm -hmm. the... We, we don't analyze football. We yeah. just... Uh, if you want my personal opinion, mm -hmm. I think uh, maybe if, if, we, if we go through the qu uh, quarterfinals, that, that's a good result. All right. Watch out for the next Euro. We'll be much stronger in two years. Well, as long as you're stronger than Netherlands two years ago, it will be good. Um, all right. Uh, thank you for uh, taking the time to talk to me. Thank you. My yeah. guest today was Axel de Boot, the co-author of Belgian Boots, now available um, at your local bookstore, probably in Brussels, on uh, Edition Or Belgium. Belgium. Or Belgium. Um, and on the internet. Also. And on the internet, of course, as an uh, e-book. Amazon. Amazon. All right. Perfect. Um, e-book. E-book. Soon. Soon. Top All right. The tweet means soon. Soon. Will it be available in English at some point? <laughs> soon. Soon. <laughs> Everything soon. Um, thank you for tuning in to um, 
my interview with uh, Axel Dubus, co-author of Belgian Boot together with Mathieu Velleu. Um, we're at New Europe Studios on Place Jourdan in Brussels, where you can Place watch Place Jourdan, like the name of the, of the editor. Yes. Oui, yeah. Place Jourdan, right. Edition Jourdan. This guy is very famous in Belgium. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Uh, New Europe Studios on Place Jourdan in Brussels, where you can watch us make the news. Thank you. Thank you.